Okay, so here we've got a question that says solve 5x squared plus 6x minus 2 equals 0. Give your solutions correct to two decimal places. Now, straight away, I can see it's a quadratic because it's got an x squared. And to two decimal places, I know I can't factorize it, so it's the quadratic formula. So I know I'm going to use the quadratic formula. And that is in the formula, on the formula page. So if I look at the formula page, I can copy it out. Or if you remember it, so minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So we need to know what a is, what b is, and what c is. So it's ax squared plus bx plus c. So a is the number before, before x squared, so a is 5. B, the number for X, that's 6. And C is the number on its own, which is minus 2. Minus 2, not plus 2, minus 2. And then all we've got to do is substitute the numbers in. So minus, and wherever I see, wherever there's a letter here, I'm going to change it for a number. So wherever I see B, I'm going to write 6. Wherever I see A, 5, whether I see C, minus 2, over 2A, so 2 fives. Okay, then I'm going to type it into the calculator. I'm going to type all of this in, exactly how it looks. So I'm going to press the fraction button first. Um, fraction button first and type it out exactly how it looks. I'm only going to do a plus first, so a plus here. You can't do a plus minus, so just a plus here. And then to two decimal places, that gives me 0 0.27. Then I'm going to go back in, so I press the back button until I reach the plus, delete it, change it to a minus, and then press equals again. And that is minus two decimal places, 1.47. So if you've got a quadratic and you see two decimal places or three significant figures, you know to use this quadratic formula and it is just a case of typing the numbers into the calculator and getting your two answers out.